I had someone who was saying, Oh, Kemuto, oh my god, you're doing YouTube shoutouts, <coughs> YouTube channel shoutouts because you want us to pay for your rent. Uh, also, living in Kenya, guys, I just a man to work, deliver with the high inflation. I removed this one, the first bunch. Mm. It's got my pillows that I still leave with me. Mm. 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 Hi guys. So all of this cost 2,400 Kenyan shillings. And then I got a promo code and 10% was off. So I ended up paying 21.78. That's roughly like more or less 21 dollars. I bought ginger, half a kg of ginger, and it's from Tigoni. From Tigoni, guys. Tigoni ginger. Yeah, local grown ginger 80 shillings because here yeah, i get it at 20 shillings so i have to buy chicken half a kg 500 grams half a kg of chicken breast boneless chicken breast 472 kenyan shillings if it's for one kg it's 8.95 but just for chicken test better I, I am yet to find somewhere else that chicken tastes better i'm gonna write it in dollars on the screen so if you're from Nambo, you know how much is. the thing i like about shopping with kafo is because they deliver at your doorstep and it costs if you don't shop up to i think 2500 shillings if your shopping is less than 2500 shillings you get a delivery fee charge of 80 shillings so that's fair so i bought this toilet toilet this is a carrefour i bought from the brand for the supermarket brand carrefour original toilet cleaner and it's three or seven kenya shillings my first time using it I use other brands this is my first time but i believe if uh if a supermarket and with the way for is established they'll try and make good products because the shower gel by the way update the shower gel i use from what the Carrefour brand is so good it takes a lead to and it's only like less than a four dollar so yeah if you want to know yeah so i'm gonna try it out and keep on watching my vlogs so that this is a grocery haul if you like these grocery hauls let me know i've not done them for quite some while and then of course my i wanted to buy the nivea cocoa butter because it was uh 400 less than this but then i remember your girl is ashy i don't play with like i found my product i've not tested the nivea yet but i got i i looked at the ingredients that i didn't see like you see here, the ingredients, the first ingredient is cocoa. With the Nivea one, uh, the first ingredient was water. So I decided to stick with what I know. But please let me know if you're actually like me, what other products you've used that you like. This smells good. I get highly recommended when I use this one. And of course, it's so expensive. It's 959 Kenyan shillings. That's like ten dollars for this for a jar of 200 grams this is my first time using nor beef cubes i wanted the, to find the bullion one but i got the chili one so this is gonna be my first time i actually use beef record beef cubes but i wanted to start to start with this one it's uh 80 shillings i wanted to try this one Yes, that's what I wanted to say. Happy Friday, by the way, guys. Today is Friday. Guys, can't wait to have a car. There was an offer 
are with pineapple guys i don't know what's wrong with pineapple like malindi pineapples they are heating and if they were so much cheaper here i bought pineapple and that's actually it's on offer it's huge though it's huge it's not so good you can see why they say it has a it's huge it's one kg 1.5 kg this size and it's a uh, gold pineapple 178 kenyan shillings so that's like roughly two dollars and it was an offer so let's get our thumbnail we've got our thumbnail you should creation is hard so it's a food so that's it from there i like i'll reuse this for i'll reuse the paper bag to throw uh, taka taka. and it's cold oh it's milk why did i buy fresh milk and i've not bought my fridge yet i'll have to cook this i'll have to I am silly. I forgot I don't have a fridge yet, guys. I'm looking out, of course, for fridge. I'm looking. I had one eighty liters of fridge, but that was huge in this smaller apartment. So I want a uh, small ninety liters. Uh, yeah, mm, LG. I want LG. So yeah, this is milk. I bought case. You see milk because. I I pray I'm Kenyan. We love tea. <laughs> mm, so this one is um I see gold crown fresh milk pouch. This is 58 Kenyan shillings. Nowadays when I'm making a recipe, I make sure I'm buying things that I'm gonna use. So yeah, I love this. This is a game changer. I saw Caribbeans. Caribbeans and Ghanaians and West Africans, let's say that they use a lot of this on their chicken. And I find out that I really love a mixture of this. The thing I've not bought is Scotch bon what's it called? Caribbean pepper. It's it's available at, at Quick Mart. I don't think it's available. I've not seen it at Carrefour yet. So I'm gonna blend and marinate this. If you ask me to do, I think I'll do a video, maybe give this video a thumbs up if you like my my two recipes um i'm getting inspired by recipes from all over the world so i'm gonna use this and i want it fresh and yet again i've remembered i have no expiry 0609 refrigerate after pass you wash before use refrigerate after pass <laughs> I have not i have no fridge what am i gonna do with this so this one is how much and it's 59 guys i need to buy a fridge really soon i did not know that my fridge people even up to now people are calling me you guys i put that fridge that day on the video and the, uh, it didn't even went two hours past the fridge got sold so maybe i should start if you want anything to be to sell anything let me know Okay, another that one is what? Why am I not finding these things? <coughs> All that time I thought I was recording, but obviously I was not as queen. Then I bought a pineapple, it was on offer, guys. Malindi pineapple. I have never tasted such a good taste of pineapple since China invaded Kenya. <laughs> Things have been tasting kind of plastic, but now, like when in Malinda and my village, food is fresh, but in Nairobi, I don't know what's happening. I tried it, I want only to drink milk tea because I'm Kenyan and we need calcium. I need to be drinking tea like on the weekend. So then I bought this Cleanest Cut Scrubber. It's my first time buying it and oh my god i regret it i regret it 
I wish you can that one for real. I don't know. I will watch my vlogs. Don't forget to leave, like this comment and continue watching my future vlogs. I will update you of how I feel about this. There are two and it's 78 shillings. Then and buy at Carrefour, guys. Buy at Carrefour. Don't say I didn't warn you. Don't say I didn't warn you. I didn't warn you. Guys, support the channel on PayPal. The cost of inflation is so high. I've just finished paying rent. By the way, rent is has increased with a thousand shillings. Too. I don't know where we are going. It's using what is quite expensive now, and we are saving for some things. It's called what? Tropical. Tro tropical. That brand is called what? If I have, I've got time to stand up here. I'll tell you. That brand is tropical and then the pine flavor. It's so good. It smells so good, sir. Yeah, freshener too. So it's good. But I'm gonna try this. Watch my vlogs. Keep on watching my vlogs. I keep on updating things I like. Products I like and products I do not like. And I'm gonna reuse this for my garbage trash. Then I bought why did I buy this? I wanted the brown one. Oh my god, and this huge guys. I really like me that I don't know about grams mileage. So I was like asking myself, why is this Mukate in table? So this is why. It's sliced bread, white bread. White bread. That's what they say. I wanted the brown one. How can I make it? May, it may so Seriously, that's serious. Okay, Kafo, buy the Kafo Mukate. I'll tell you about this before. But this, buy the one with the brown one. It's so good. So it's huge. So it's gonna be eating it with sandwich. I want to make something. So yeah, that's all my nine, ten. Ten items I was charged delivery because. My nini it was not 2500 when you shop for 2500 that's when you get free delivery but delivery is not expensive it's 80 Kenyan shillings and you know i don't have a car so it was best for me because even fair to go there and the hustle and to carry so it works really perfectly because they deliver up to they deliver up to your door but where i live they don't allow entrance main gate like main gate even pizza delivery you cannot get up to the gate but it's good because i don't know what i'm talking about that's all the shopping i did for today let me know if you like this kind of videos let me know in the comment section down below there was something okay let me bring the the toilet cleaner i like this is what it's all it's finishing that's why i bought the Carrefour four brand i'll show the Carrefour four brand tell you but this one Imagine it is 500 ml. It you need to use a little because any kiddo go not make to go. I've been using it for like almost since March. Yeah, and it's August now. Like the like I think it's finished. So this one is really good. I wanted to buy this one, but then it was expensive, so I went with the other one. And it's true to its death. It removes the infection there and kills them. That is very true. Okay. This Carrefour brand is really good. And then I took the Iris and Clarice. It a little goes a long way. So I like it. Also, another body wash. Then this one, well, it was expensive. But I got it at Carrefour also. But it's so good also. Very, very good. I highly recommend it. I want to go and buy the Ocolipair cream conditioner so yeah if you like this kind of videos don't forget to hit the subscribe button like if you haven't happy friday it's actually friday and i'm thinking i'm gonna upload this video to die today another update of the house is i want to change i want to change the lay the bed to be in the window so that when i wake up i can see the view i can see outside because my mental is really affected um and i hope you like this kind of video this is a random video but i just wanted to show you how the inflation has really affected 
it has really affected us kenya for all those products that cost me 24 dollars more so less yeah less than less than 24 usd dollar because the dollar is currently at 119 the exchange rate but in kenya shillings that all cost is 2412 kenya shillings but then i got a promo code Kafo really love me and I love them. So Kafo, let's do something. Let's work together. And if you want to advertise here, yeah, my email is on, always on the description box and I put it on my screen also for easy reference. And also for those who want YouTube shout outs, I had someone was saying, oh, Kemuto, oh my God, you're doing YouTube shout outs, <coughs> YouTube channel shout outs because you want us to pay for your rent. Uh, da, I've been doing this for five years. If you didn't know, now you know. Now on the, you're on the radar. And people complained about me charging 2,500 Kenyan shillings for advertisement. But it's the quality, guys. It's the quality. The quality. I do more than other channels when you, when you give me, when, like, it is proven. It is highly proven that my views are original <laughs> um, it is highly proven you get back your money's worth with the 2500 kenyan shillings i'm also even it's a uh, shout out and i put your link on the description of my upcoming video and i also allow you to record uh not more than 30 second video of you yourself which i will integrate on the video promoting your channel and it's a win-win solution am i right or am i not so it depends on where you want me to place it so just contact me on my number business only i don't want hi hey i don't answer to those because guys i get over 100 so the most important come first and you know the most important is what money because that's a business number guys that's not our friendship number anyway guys that's all for today as always your girl and i don't mean youtube channels uh, youtube shouters youtube shout outs it's not k tribe there's k tribe and then there's youtube channel there are people who are youtubers you know there's a difference there's a difference between that two you want me to promote your channel I work so hard to to get these views and numbers if you're a youtuber you already know how hard it is to get even one view and my channel is a business right now and i have to act business wise no feelings no emotions business we both mutually benefit okay okay if you haven't learned everything or if you want clarification qua comments hakuna vita opinion this opinion and this truth and I'm hungry right now. Bye. It's 3 p.m. right now and I've decided to marinate my chicken. And I've decided because I'm a good YouTuber, I show you how I do it. So I've already like cut slits on my chicken, both of my chicken. So I'm gonna blend in here. We have the thyme, thin, thin thyme. Okay, so will I take this other one or should I dry it over my <laughs> over my window so it dries and then I have dry herb? Comment down below if that's a good idea or I'll just Google. Comment, comment guys. We need those because, yeah, so I've put some leaves, thyme leaves. They smell so good already. And then I've put white wine vinegar. This one. White wine vinegar. And I've put... <coughs> Also, Spanish paprika, black pepper. Guys, my spaces from Kiliman all Kilimanjaro are finished and I'm sad. And then I've put this type of garlic. I prefer this type of garlic. I'll show you where I shop them very, very soon. I want to buy a, another fridge, so I'll show you when I buy that. So, yeah, I think that's all. And ginger, yes, and garlic. Put and salt, that's all, and a little bit of oil. I use my Phyllis blender. This is the best blender. <laughs> it has Imeishi blender more than three years. 
So I will use this one. Oh, with that it has blended. So that's my green paste. <laughs> that's my green paste. I'm gonna massage it inside. Massage it inside. Make sure it's completely marinated because I can't do it with one hand. Mm, it smells so good, guys. If you haven't tried, try it and then let me know. I put clean thing, clean thing on it, so it's gonna marinate for four hours. Yeah, this is a game changer. I'll show it in another video. So I have decided to cut this chicken into slices and the oil is hot 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 so now it's around i think now it's around uh seven or so 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 i've decided because i want my chicken i want to bake slice it yes I wish I would have marinated even inside. It's okay. I have decided my pieces to be like this. This small smooth. Add a bunch. It looks good. I removed this one, the first bunch. See how cute it is? The second one on my, on my chicken, and I'm remaining this. And then I will just add the onion. I forgot to, to have green capsicum and yellow. So if you have it, you can add it. I'll show you. Add the other one on the end. No, I didn't take uh, chicken, but I just love it. It's different. Chili beef cube. So I just not beef. I feel I've added a lot of salt. You know, the crazy bit is not going to salt. So I can turn it quite safe. Maybe be safe. No, you feel it. Instead of adding, I'm gonna add the big camera rice. Will be ready. That's my chicken. The chicken is ready. Mmm, bon appetit. Do you guys want a mukbang? This is so good. I love, I love onions. I'll eat this with a bow. Guys, my attempt for a mukbang. Please don't laugh at me.
So here's my mukbang. Ugali. My chicken. And of course, lemon slices. And this is my first mukbang. Let's eat together. <laughs> How do they eat? They always like this. <laughs> okay, I'm not laughing at anyone, please. So, let's taste everything. First bite for you guys. Pokachundi, can be in the menu, but other than that, it is juicy and it is that's the only thing I don't like using the, the beef cubes. You may end up over salting your food. I love to not to love salt. So I love onions. My first mukbang. No, this is not my first mukbang. Maybe my first mukbang here. Yeah. But I've been doing mukbang since before they were known. And this is green colored in English. It is not kale swallow. They may to say it's kale, it's not. It is called Kumariki in Kenya, obviously. In Mukbang, do you need to finish the food on, on camera? I think I should stop putting salt when I'm using the cubes because the chicken was okay. But the minute I had the not beef, This is lemon too. <laughs> lemon ginger tea. <clears throat> Guys, I feel so lonely. I never had anyone say that. Well, and imagine I'm an introvert, so while I try to cook. Now what? How do they feel? I've tried different chicken, but kafo chicken is the best, honestly. It doesn't disgust you. Honestly, I am full. And I said to Kuringa or Kamila, I'm a poor go power But the shame is in This is my problem. When I cook, my appetite goes. Wow. 
okay guys see you in another one bye and if this is a leftover but still a fit <laughs> watch this video because i want to buy a cool fridge what do you look out for because i want a fridge that doesn't make a lot of a noise like no low noise okay guys bye bye